tried to take it away and you failed because your daughter hated you. There was something else that I wanted to say. I forgot now. Anyway. Delta was in top form today. The guards tried to make him take another dose of whatever the hell it is they're pumping into him. And he managed to take on all four of them at once. Snapping legs and arms. Blood everywhere. They say one of the guys might not even wake up. I wish I could be that free. Huh. So... Yeah, so I always had free will. Delta was the first prototype. I don't know if I said this or if the game has said this. But yeah, Delta always had more free will than all the other big daddies because I'm the first one and they didn't figure out at that point that the uh, control was necessary. Okay, I'm going back. I'm going the wrong way. So that tape just talked about how Delta beat up a bunch of guards because <laughs> they tried to make him take some plasmids. Funny. Alright. Uh, music. I don't like music. I don't like copyrighted music. Where's that music coming from? Here? Damn it. Well, uh, never mind that. Let's just get through this place quickly, I guess. I don't even recognize that music. They're using really obscure songs. Hopefully that means I won't get copyright claims on my videos. Ouch. Steady, father. Don't let go now. All right. Ah, a brute splicer. And an alpha series. Are we supposed to be worried because something killed those two? Water. Water is a fascinating substance. Wake up! Why don't you wake up? Pain is no man's wage. Okay, is this whole place is flooded and all the inmates are dead? Interesting. Not much to see outside. I will not lose another patient! I need help in here, quickly! Where is that damn nurse? Don't you dare expire! Don't you dare! They're already dead, bro. You don't have anyone to lose. I will not lose another patient! Is he gonna attack us or not? Quickly. Where is that damn nurse? Uh, I guess he's not gonna attack us. Don't you dare expire! Don't you dare! That's funny. Oh. Um, what's this? This is a new place, I think. Oh no, this is an old place. Okay, this is uh, the way back out. Oh, hello, Alpha Series. Let me stand in the water. Hmm. Alright, so there's more of this. That guy is still not attacking us. I will not lose another present! Where's the Alpha series? There he is. So he's still alive. So yeah, just more enemies, more corridors and rooms. Same strategies will work just fine. The security camera's triggered. It's just this, yeah, it really is just the same thing over and over again now. I need help in here, quickly! Where is that damn nurse? I don't know. Oh, 
And Sophia Lamb, like... Yeah, like, I, I said this before, I think. Like, she was so intelligent towards the start of the game. But now, like, all of her fallacies and, and straw man arguments are coming out. I think I would have preferred it if they could have managed to make her remain intelligent. Like, not have her... You know, keep pushing invalid arguments. You know, just because it's the end of the game and you're supposed to be her enemy, it doesn't mean that you need to make it so that she doesn't make sense or she's not logical or anything like that. Like, you know, in the X-Men, Magneto always had a very good argument, even though he's wrong, like, you know, you could understand it. And they set it up so that... You know, he's not completely... just mistaken about some really basic things, like Dr. Lamb is here. I mean, she's a psychiatrist, but she's projecting all of her mistakes onto you, the the main character, and that's a, that's like a really basic a psychology mistake. Is that a turret? It is. What is this stuff? Oh, ambush is what this is. Ow, my face. What just happened? Is that an alpha series? It is. Okay. What is this? Door release. Okay. But why would I... Ow. Release it. Still getting injured. Okay, I can't. Can you stop firing now, please? Thanks. Oh, okay. Repair that. Oh, look. Power to the people. I guess I'll get the rivet gun clip size and then that. Hmm. Not that it's useful. Yeah, like, they, they're giving you a lot of upgrades at the very last level, I don't... Why would they do that? Why not give it to you earlier? If you have that many upgrades for your weapons, and you have that many levels in the game, why wouldn't you space them out evenly? Guess I had the wrong of it when it came to Dr. Lamb. She explained how my cravings for control would rob me out from the inside. We found all these incidents in my log where I made it easy for a convict to get the jump on me, just so I could bloody punish him. Christ. But I believe I could do some good down here now, with the family. Well, we have a shot at surviving the fucking bedlam going on up there. Maybe even take the city back. Okay, so the... Uh, Dr. Lamb is getting to everyone down here. Now, why would I let him out? Is there loot in here? Like, why would I release the door? <laughs> Holy cow, there's more than one of them. And they're shooting right at me. Are they... No, he's still alive. 60% health. Okay, 30% health. 10% health. One's dead. There's one more. 30... Okay, the rocket is actually firing at its target dummy. And dead. 
And we're fine, okay. Now what's in here? Frag grenades, frag grenades. Dead person. Heat seeking RPG. So there's nothing really useful there. A little bit of loot. That's really dark. Auto hack. Draws. There's nothing here worth taking. Like, why would I release them? What was the point of that? Uh, anyway, let me stand in the water for a little bit. And my bots are doing nothing. Really. Alright. Oh, Eve is back up. And, no, it's not a coincidence that I'm starting to have complaints about the game at the very end. It, it happens to a lot of games that, you know, towards the end they just run out of time and money and they have to start cutting content and so then you know, they don't get to finish the game the way they like and then the quality starts to suffer and it's it's not easy to plan the plan the game design process so that You know, you get the timing right and get everything you want done completed in the in the right time. You know, games get delayed all the time. And sometimes people complain about delays. But then you have to ask the question, you know, do you, do you prefer delays or do you prefer... Or, you know, rather, or do, you, do you prefer the game being out on time or do you prefer them to spend more time to make it a better game, right? So. It's not a it's not an easy question. And also, I mean if you're smart, I guess you would make sure you don't leave out the end of the game, so you would work on the end of the game. <laughs> You'd work on the final levels of the game before you work on some of the other less important stuff. So instead of developing the game chronologically, like you start from the beginning and, and finish at the end, you start with the more important stuff. And then you end with the less important stuff. But at the same time keeping in mind that as you develop the game, your people will learn a lot about the develop development process and they'll get better at it. You know, as they become more familiar with the story, more familiar with the game engine, and more familiar with just the the process, they'll get better at it. And I don't know, I know, I don't I don't have any answers. I'm not a game developer myself, so I don't know the inner workings of it, but you know, trying to get you know, trying to match the most important parts of the game with the most appropriate time to get the people to work on it, I, I think is a an interesting question. Now, one of the girls managed to dart past the nurse today and throw herself over the railing in the lobby. Not certain if she was trying to end her own life or, or merely escape. But either way, her legs had healed by the time I managed to get down to the first floor where she lay. Now, without proper setting, the rapid healing process had fused her bones back together at odd angles. We had to re-break and set them almost a dozen times each due to the small window of viability. Now those children may be immortal, but I can verify, they feel pain. Advising Dr. Lamb on higher doses of sedatives to keep this from happening again. That's terrible. That's terrible. They're immortal, but they feel pain. That's terrible. Anyway. Really? Another ambush? And that issue of, you know, timing and scheduling of the game design process, I like similar problems occur in architectural design as well.